Hi, Shiv here. You know what I hate? Is when you film a whole bunch of stuff on your webcam, photo booth on Mac, and then you play it and discover, oh, there's no sound. <laughs> All right, so what I was blogging before was about what I did this Saturday, which some people are going, oh, great, we're gonna fill in on the life story, hey? But no, this Saturday I had something that might interest some of you on the wide, wide, wide web. I was at Twilight Prom. Twilight Prom in Melbourne. That was for Australia. Talents and Eddie Gathegi came down. That was so much fun. I'll tell you now. Even not having them to talk to the whole night. I mean, there was a, there, it was not like they were, the, it was, wasn't was like a one-on-one -on -one thing, you know. But it was still amazing. I remember when I went to get my photo done, I was so excited. I was just excited, I was nervous, so I woke up and I'm like, oh, hi guys, how's it going? And, um, you know, I said hello, I was like, how are you, and the, you know, good, all that. I stand between them and... They both put their arms around me, which I'm sure I'm not the only one. But I couldn't believe how tight Callum was d d holding on to me. I was like, what? Oh, my God. thought they'd be a bit distant, but Callum, even in my photo, you can see his, like, arm around me. And I was like, wow, that's amazing. And after the photo, I was a bit in shock. And I'm like, wow, that was snuggly. And Callum just... His face lit up and he's like, oh, it's cuddly snuggly, or snuggly cuddly, something like that, either way. And I was just like, oh my god, didn't know what to say or do, so I'm just like, <laughs> and just kept walking, collected my camera, because um, I was doing a bit of photography for the night, which was good, I was excited to do that. So I got lots of good photos of Kel and Eddie, some, some really good ones to share, which um, I guess I'll link wherever it is up there to you so you can all check them out and let me know what you think. Um, but yeah, it was a good night. Really good night. I mean, um, I keep saying I mean and I like a lot. Sorry. Um, when Kel and Eddie came out, it was really good because there was a moment where you got to take photos and all that. So I was kind of just standing with a camera like up above everyone so I could actually get some photos because I'm kind of, you know, I'm a little kid. I'm old, but I'm little, so <laughs> it makes no sense. Um, I look younger than I am too, so I guess that'll be an upside when I'm 30. Um... So that was exciting, and as Callan started making his way through the crowd to get to, you know, where he had, they had to talk, him and Eddie, he's, he's doing his little career, and I'm like, career with Callan, and he turned to me and he winked at me, and I'm like, oh, wow, I feel special. A couple of times I felt special, because I just, yeah, I'm not afraid to say stuff to them. I'm just like, yeah, whatever. Everybody else is kind of like, ooh, I think. But yeah, it was good. I um, got to see him up close at one point. I was standing with a whole crowd of girls and he came up. And <laughs> I will never forget this. There was a girl standing next to me. Like, I was here, she was there, some other girl was there, and Kellen was, you know, over there. And he, we're talking a lot. Well, I wasn't, I didn't actually get to ask him something because it was a pretty large crowd, which was a bit disappointing. But, um, they were asking questions and she turns him and asks him a question and he turned and answered and I don't know who else realised but I realised she realised that a bit of spit came out of his mouth when he talked and it like hit her and we are like oh okay and kept going and after he'd left she turned to me and she goes oh my god oh my god Callan just spat on me and I was full just laughed and went oh you lucky girl I'm just how exciting! That's amazing! And I'm like, you lucky girl, I wish that was me! I just, the sad thing is, I'm not half lying. <laughs> Bit of Kellen lets his spit comes flying out of his mouth and has to hit someone! It might as well be me. Or 
likely her. <laughs> so that was an upside to the night and a bit of a shocker. But it was good. Um Callan and um um Eddie dance quite a bit together and there was one moment I can't remember what they were doing I think they were like hugging or they were really close or they were dancing or something and I had my camera at that stage and the batteries were running dead because everybody had I, everybody been taking photos on my camera of random things like us just out there and I'm like oh ah! and I didn't have any spare batteries because there was a whole fuss at the start of the night with batteries so I didn't have any spare ones and the batteries were dying and I'm going, I'm like pressing the button, I'm like, no, why did you take the picture? And I just, afterward I went, after they separated and they were moving off the stage, I just go, damn it, camera! And I look up and there's Callan, he's like, I can't believe you just missed that, man. I'm like, I know, Callan, it's insane. He's like, oh, that's just too bad. And I'm like, oh my God. It sort of hit me then. I'm like, holy crap. That's Kellen Lutz. That's Emmett Cullen. I'm t in the same country and room as him. That was a big shock there. And um, it, it was all just, it's all just kind of dreamy right now. It's, I can't believe it happened, but it did happen. And that's so exciting. But yeah, anyway. I'm running up on seven minutes now. I don't think you want to listen to me going on for seven minutes and hopefully it recorded sound. Um, 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 um. I wanted to s know if anybody else had videos out there on YouTube because I um, definitely want to check them out. Who knows who or what and people I know, people, me, might be in them. So it would be nice to check them out. So link me if you have any. And um, I'm going to post a link to my photography, which you can take it, check out. I've got mostly just um, Eddie and Callan photos. Unfortunately, I was going to go around and take photos of everyone at the event and take portraits of people attending, but um, <laughs> I thought I should save my battery and also I was a bit too scared to ask everyone. So next event... Definitely keep an eye out for me because I'm going to build up the confidence and I'm going to ask everyone for their portraits and take some wonderful photos because I'm sure you'd all like that. But yes, that's pretty much all I have to say for now. And if I think of anything else I have to mention, you'll hear from me again. Bye, guys.